Good morning, beautiful people. Happy freaking Friday. We made it through this week. We got Super Bowl Sunday coming up. We got Valentine's Day on Monday. We got a big weekend in store. So let's let's just have a day today. Let's have a Friday. And let's hop into the little morning message this morning. So I'm um, just going to talk a little bit about uh, my experience and a little testimonial on um, the 75 Heart program that I have been doing. So nothing too deep or crazy today. Just going to be a little life update almost over the past month for me. And uh, yeah, happy Friday, February 11th, 2022. So, so I just wanted to hop into speaking a little bit about what I have learned and discovered about myself over the past 32 full days. Today's day 33 so far. And I intend to do the additional phases of this Live Hard program after I complete 75 Hard, um, which will be completed sometime in March, I guess, if I don't fail, which I will not fail. So yeah, here we go. So after thinking about it a little bit, um, what I've really noticed about this challenge or program, if you will, is that it's more so about creating these habits, these healthy habits to change, to really like, almost like calibrate your life, like physically, mentally, um, you know, emotionally, you name it. And once you develop these habits, they then just really just become a part of, they become you, like you, they become who you are. Um, and so you, you kind of are becoming this, the best, most powerful, most confident, most healthy version of yourself. And you have, it's, you know, a complete, what this has actually given me is provided me a, a complete and full method of full accountability for myself. And when I really think about it, what I've benefited the most from it is, you know, I kind of was always doing the physical aspect of it besides like a second outdoors workout, like for the majority of my life, um, as far as like the weight training goes, I was pretty much getting like my water in most days as well. Um, and I'd read here and there, but it wasn't, it wasn't like an intention of mine that it did without compromise, without exception, no questions asked every single day. Um, and the biggest thing that I've realized is, is really becoming almost obsessed with like bettering, like becoming a better version of myself. And I think that's been the biggest realization in that, like you can always you can always do better at something. Um, and each day is a new opportunity to do better than you did the day before. And you should always be looking to obviously challenge yourself to do to become a better version of yourself um, each and every day. And I think that's what's really benefited me the most from from, from doing these and, and ensuring that I do these things with the I guess, punishment of having to start over. And that is what I do not want to do and that will not happen. And overall, it's really just gotten me to, one, believe in my own capabilities and really know that if there's anything that I want to do or need to do, that it will get done because of the accountability and discipline that, that doing this program has taught me. So, you know, by, I'm no, I'm by no means close to, close to being done. I'm th day 33 of 75 so far. But yeah, I just wanted to speak a little bit on some of the positive aspects that I have got, that I have gained from it in that you know, I've gained a lot of confidence, um, complete accountability, um, totally you know, calibrated myself to becoming this healthy, the best healthy version of myself that almost embraces these hard challenges and then it ultimately becomes who I am as a person. And I've always thought this and believed this, but really doing this over the past month has really affirmed this belief, is that you are, by every single definition and means of, of the, of what I'm about to say, exactly what this is, is that you are, you are exactly what you think you are. And if you think you are someone who wakes up early, who works out, who drinks a gallon of water, who reads, who learns, who embraces challenges, who does seemingly objectively 
hard or difficult things and does them without compromise and does them with focus, with intention, with passion, with optimism and joy and positivity. If you truly believe that, that is who you are as a person. And that is who you will always be. And if you think that you are someone that fully firmly believes that you will keep getting better every single day and knows that, that each day is an opportunity to get better, then how could you ever get worse? Like how could you ever fail at something? And I think that's really the biggest takeaway that I've gotten from this program is that it's really just a tool to kind of mentally calibrate your mind because really if you believe in your mind that you are someone who is about these things, like um, that's what I'm about. And like you tell yourself that, like that is what I am about. I am someone who does these things even when I don't wanna do them because they might seem hard, but we're gonna do them anyway because I know that they will morph me into a better version of myself that I was always supposed to become, then that is exactly who you will be and who you will always be. And the coolest thing about these habits that I spoke on before at the start of this message is that once you develop these healthy habits, once you actually become someone who is about these healthy habits, it every single day, it's like a deposit. It just stacks and stacks and stacks. And it's that much harder to then break, that much harder to then go back to who you used to be maybe, or to to create an unhealthy habit. Like once you start stacking these healthy habits, healthy habits, I am I am about doing these hard things, I'm about be, being this healthy version of myself, the best version of myself, then it's so super cool to realize that it's that much harder every single day that you do this because you're, 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 you're also forced, you're kind of like forcing yourself to believe that this is true. And you're like, dang, like this is actually true. Like I'm actually doing this we're, and we're getting it done that it's actually that much harder to then reverse that. And yeah, that's pretty much all I just wanted to uh, update you on with this little morning message um, today on this beautiful freaking Friday. Um, and yeah, if, uh, if you are looking to challenge yourself, start a new program um, this year, I would highly recommend uh, 75 Hard. Super challenging, but you can only get better, and you will get better. So, the best freaking Friday today. Keep killing it, keep staying positive, keep staying happy, and going about your days with a freaking smile, and yeah, I will see you guys soon. Love you. Have a good Friday. Peace.